can a civil engineer become an architect? If you're a civil engineer wondering if you can transition into the world of architecture, you're not alone. Many professionals in the construction industry consider switching roles at some point in their careers. Let's break down what it takes to make this transition. First, let's look at the educational background required for each profession. Civil engineers typically hold a bachelor's or master's degree in civil engineering, which takes around four to five years to complete. Architects, on the other hand, usually earn a five-year Bachelor of Architecture degree or go on to get a master's degree, adding another one to three years. To become an architect, a civil engineer would need additional education and training in architecture. This could involve pursuing a Master of Architecture M. Arch, degree, which covers subjects like urban design, town planning, and building design. This program helps bridge the gap between the technical skills of a civil engineer and the creative and design-focused skills of an architect. In terms of skills, civil engineers are strong in structural analysis, construction management, and mathematics, particularly in areas like calculus and trigonometry. They are also proficient in computer-aided design CAD software and have excellent problem-solving and communication skills. Architects, however, focus more on design aesthetics, spatial functionality, and visual communication. They need to be creative and have a good sense of how spaces function and feel. The work environment and responsibilities also differ. Civil engineers are involved in the project from the conceptual phase to the completion of construction, ensuring the structural soundness and safety of the building. Architects are primarily engaged in the early stages of the project, focusing on the design, layout, and overall appearance of the building. For a civil engineer to become an architect, they would need to complete the necessary educational requirements and gain the specific skills and knowledge that architects possess. This includes passing the Architect Registration Examination, ARE, to obtain an architectural license, which is a requirement to practice as an architect. In summary, while it is possible for a civil engineer to become an architect, it requires additional education, training, and obtaining the necessary licenses. It's a significant but achievable transition for those willing to put in the time and effort to acquire the new skills and knowledge required for a career in architecture.